In this video, I'm going to show you why you shouldn't use the PS5's USB Type-C port for charging your PlayStation 5 controller. While it is true that you can use any USB port on the PS5 to charge your DualSense controller, many users claim that if you use the USB Type-C port, your controller will actually charge faster. So I decided to test this myself by taking two completely dead DualSense controllers, charging one on USB-A and one on USB-C, and then timing the results. We'll start off testing USB-A and then compare it to USB Type-C. For the controller charged on the front-facing USB-A port, the time to charge was just over 2 hours. Now let's see how this compares when the controller is charged on USB Type-C. And once again, the time to charge the PS5 DualSense controller on USB Type-C was just over two hours. So my recommendation is do not use the USB Type-C port to charge your PS5 controller, and instead use it for something more useful like an extended SSD for more storage and more games. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video and you found it useful or at least interesting, and if you did, make sure to leave a like rating on this video, comment below to let me know what you think, and as always, don't forget to subscribe and ring the bell for post notifications. Also get some experience.